Hello, my name is Louis Hunt and I'm here interviewing Jennifer Hunt, a primary school teacher. Did you know that in 2022, in Great Britain, 5.1 billion passenger journeys were made on public transport vehicles? I believe that public transport is a crucial aspect to our day and age. They don't only help you save money, but they have tremendous benefits to help reduce our carbon emissions and cut down on air pollution. The government invested £4.34 billion into public transport in 2022 to 2023. This is important as it promotes the use of public transport to the community. With this interview, I plan to get the views and opinions of a general member of the public to give us some insight on how she feels about public transport and whether it is beneficial to her and her community or whether public transport is not worth having. How do you feel about public transport and how does it impact your life? Um, I'm really frustrated with public transport and I mean I don't have to take it but the times that I do want to take public transport to meet up with friends um, or just go to visit lots of different places um, I find it costly, I find that it's infrequent, I find like it takes a longer time to get there. Um, doesn't have a major impact on my life because that's what because I choose to have a car um, but I think my life would be a bit more varied and, and uh, I'd feel like I was doing more for the environment if I was able to take public transport. Uh, interesting. Do you believe that more people should use public transport more often? Yeah, um, I do agree that people should use public transport more often. I do believe that obviously it's, it's a better option for the environment. I just can understand the frustrations that people have in terms of the cost and the effort it takes sometimes uh, because of timetables and infrequency of, of uh, buses and trains. Agreed. Have you ever used public transport to get to a workplace and if so where? It was a long time ago that I used public transport to get to a workplace. It was probably my, my late teens and early twenties. So I used to travel um, to another destination in Warrington. It did mean that I had to get a bus to the Warrington Town Centre and then had to get another bus to my workplace, which was really quite frustrating um, and time consuming. Um, I've since found, sort of 30 odd years later, that that's still the case. There is still no direct bus route to my old workplace and I would still have to get two buses to there. Have you ever used public transport to meet up with your friends? Yeah, I have. Yeah, over many years I've, I've, I've tried to use public transport to uh, meet up with friends usually when it's nights out when um, we you know we want to have a drink and things but yeah I've used the train and I've used uh, a bus do you think public transport helps the environment I suppose the the obvious answer is if lots of people use it then it will cut carbon emissions if people choose to, to use public transport uh, rather than um, cars etc. How do you think public transport impacts the general public? Um, I suppose it depends on if uh, the general public are trying to get to busy places like cities or major towns you know this can be a a great thing for those people because uh, it cuts down on parking uh, fees and the time taken to, to find parking spaces etc so you know they get to the destination quicker um, so it can be quite a, a positive impact um, but sometimes again it can be frustrating. Interesting.
Have you ever used public transport abroad? And if so, what did you use? Yeah, uh, I've been very fortunate to be able to use public transport abroad. Um, I've used buses and I've even uh, used sort of like mini buses type thing. I found them really good. Um, again, the frequency of those were, were, were good and the cost was um, a lot cheaper. So it was much more appealing. And what place did you use? Uh, I've used um, the buses uh, in Spain quite recently. Uh, in the past I've used a train in France. What do you think could improve about public transport? Again, if, if it was less costly it would be more appealing to people and then again if um, there were more frequent trips again it would be more appealing to people. What is your favourite form of public transport and why? I'd probably say the train is my favourite form of public transport. I usually get a chance to sit and relax uh, on the train. Um, obviously there are times where I don't get a seat so that can be a bit frustrating. As a primary school teacher, have you ever used public transport to go on a school trip? And if so, where did you go? Uh, I don't recall ever using public transport for a school trip. Um, we tend to book buses or coaches um, to take us on, or, you know, to have taken us to the, those places. Um, so we, we have been locally to uh, the town centre for museum trips, but we've been further afield um, to other venues in the northwest generally. Did you find this more useful? Um, to be able to book the coach or the bus was useful in terms of you were felt you were reassured that that was going to turn up um, and it was exclusively for, for you or your, your group. Do you ever feel sick on public transport and if so what form of transport? I have felt sick on public transport um, and that's been across the board really whether it, it might have been a bus, a train or, or a plane and that's usually because um, I might feel sort of crammed or hot and stuffy yeah that's generally the case Overall what do you believe is better in general using your car or using a form of public transport? I think at this moment in time, in the place that I live, um, using a car for me uh, works best to suit my lifestyle. I am conscious in the environment. I, I am lucky enough to own a hybrid car, so I can be you know, uh, aware of how my impact on the environment. I would love it though, if there were um, better transport options. From this interview, I have listened to the opinions on public transport from a member of the public. I have listened to new interesting ideas on the subject, such as how Jennifer felt about public transport, and have lots of information to take away from these questions. This interview allows us to be open-minded and take in others' personal takes and thinking. Thanks for tuning in to our wonderful radio show where we discuss relevant daily topics. I have been your host, Louis Hunt, interviewing our guest, Jennifer Hunt, in our discussion on the topic of public transport. Mm.